I grilled the hell out of them about the engine cover. Because if you guys don't know, you pull the seats off, the engine compartment is 100% sealed. I was like, why does this exist? And he said, it was the only way, it was the only way that we could get the seat small enough. He goes, because we wanted a narrow seat. We wanted to narrow the seat all the way around. We wanted it really narrow at the front. We wanted it narrow, narrow, narrow. But the only way we could design it that we could think of, that it would seal up the engine compartment and have the narrow seat that we wanted, was if we had that panel. He goes, and the panel's held on by like six acorn screws. It's, it's, you know, it's pretty easy to pop off. But that panel allows them to have a more narrow seat. And they said that was more, that was more of a, that was the narrowed seat and the better ergonomics. And there is a nice, very nice knee cove that comes in. But they did say the number one reason was because we wanted the ergonomics of the narrow seat. And that was why that cover exists. I go, well, Yamaha did the exact same thing. And he goes, yeah, they have a, what they call an upper deck, and the upper deck um, goes over the lower deck, and that allows them to step it up to a more narrow seat. And he goes, that's really what we ended up doing. And I said, so it wasn't to keep people from getting into their engine compartment? And he goes, no, not really. Um, he says, we interview owners, and most owners don't do their own maintenance. And I was like, oh, dude, no, don't say that. Don't. Don't go down that path. Um, but he he was like, well, you know, again, the mechanically inclined guy can pull the seat and then take an impact or, you know, a little driver, a little electric driver. So, yeah, you just take all six of them off. Off it goes. And you got the full engine compartment. Okay. You know, but again, look what Sea-Doo did. Sea-Doo has 13 of those stupid torque screws. So you're kind of like, Fine. <laughs> you kind of just accept it. Go, okay, fine. All right. Hey, guys. Thanks for hanging out. This clip was taken from our weekly podcast that we record here every Sunday night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you want to watch the whole video, you can go to the Watercraft Journal's YouTube channel, go to Playlists, and then click on Live Sessions. You're going to see it there. Otherwise, go ahead and leave a like, a comment, and definitely subscribe to the channel. It helps us grow. And again, thanks again for watching our videos, and we hope to see you soon.